an impact wrench driving a one inch screw. Ready? Go. Done. Not even the anvil was hitting the hammer. Take it out. Perfect. I love this adapter. So alrighty, today what we are going to do is we are going to explore an adapter that I got on Amazon around the same time I bought this one inch impact wrench. I'm going to give a huge shout out to Tool Review Zone because he uploaded this before I did. This was going to be today's video and so, uh, but he uploaded it before I can. Alright, so this adapter is actually extremely unique. because This adapter allows you to use your impact wrench to drive in screws. And so I think that is extremely unique because if that's the case, then you could actually replace your impact driver with an impact wrench, especially if it's compact like the stubby. We're also going to test it out on the M12 stubby. It isn't really a versus video. All right, for control time, we're going to use the Milwaukee impact driver just to see if there's a huge time difference between these two. So I think this adapter has major potential to for people to actually not use their impact driver anymore and to use their impact wrench to drive in screws. I found this exploring special sockets for this because I originally wanted to get a one inch drive socket to a half inch adapter so I could use this on this one inch impact wrench. And so that's I'm still going to do that because I'm curious on how I'm curious on the time on how this actually drives and screws because this channel does that type of thing. But this video, we're gonna test this out on the M18 stubby, M12 stubby, and for, like I said, for a control time, let's test out the impact driver. So as you can see, this has a half inch socket right there. Then on the end, it has a quarter inch hex adapter. So this is not a quick insert collet. Then you just put that in and then you're good to go. And so now you could use your impact wrench to actually drive in screws, which I find that extremely interesting. So that's pretty much it. So let's uh, test this out. Alrighty, so first we are gonna test out the M12 stubby. These are $9 uh, for two of them. And so it's, it actually is a great deal. That actually is a great deal. So when it comes to me, I get actually get to do versus videos with them live. So please subscribe to the channel. I do live stuff as well. So first let's do a control with the impact driver. Speed three, battery is full. It doesn't matter what battery. Eight amp hour, eight amp hour, six amp hour. All right, so this is not a versus video. All right, so let's do a control test. Let's see what the time for this is. Ready, go. Time. All right, so right here is good. All right, so ready, little balancing act, ready, go. Time. All right, so let's take that out for, oh, we got one more. That's for one more specs. All right, so. Ready, go. Time. All right, now let's take it out. Ready, go. Impact to impact wrench, taking out screws. Now let's take this one out next. Ready, go. Sorry, I, I slipped. Then let's have the impact driver take it out. Ready, go. This this thing is this, this one is fast. This one is fast, but that just shows you that you could actually use your impact wrench to t uh, drive in screws if you don't feel like carrying both around. Now you have the best of both worlds. You have your, your anvil still, and you have your collet. So it's a, just by having an adapter, you have two tools in one. So this is just to show you on how this actually works. Now, I personally love this. 
Now, in my opinion, I would rather have an impact wrench than an impact driver because in my history of doing these videos, I have broken, I have broken and snapped so many quarter inch hex to a half inch adapters to where I, I, I probably spent like 80 bucks on these so far. So with this, by using an impact wrench instead of an impact driver, you'll never need to replace this anvil unless if you completely purposely destroy the tool and you get two of these adapters for $10. You know, you just could put regular screws in there. And in my opinion, that is seriously, seriously awesome. And so, yeah, uh, I'll put the link. I'm actually going to put the link for this in the description below because it is that handy. I did not, this was not sent to me. I bought this. And so I just found this on Amazon and it's actually a very useful adapter. Like it'll save people a lot of money by not having to have two tools. You could have buy one tool and spend $10 and get two of these. And then you will technically have two tools because now you're using an impact wrench to drive in some screws. So I just want to show you guys this. And once again, I'm going to give a tool review zone a shout out, go to his channel, subscribe. He does some excellent stuff. He's always up to date on the latest and greatest. If you found this video helpful and entertaining, please, like this video, please hit the bell button to be notified of future videos, and please subscribe to the channel. This is Dave Nicholas, thank you for tuning in, I'll see you guys next time.